Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 37, and this is war number seven. And we're going up against an alliance called Symbiotic Soldiers. And let's see who they have banned. All right, Ghost, Hercules, and Kingpin. Take a look at what we got here. All right, they've already cleared out the middle. That's nice. All right, so we've got Silver Surfer, um, and we've got Iron Man Infinity War. Now, I'm, I'm nervous about the Iron Man Infinity War because he can be annoying. I, I think Namor can take this on this particular node. Um, should be able to. Uh, I'm tempted to bring in, well, if I brought in Magneto, I'm afraid that I'll run into this other issue here. So I'm going to try Namor and see how that works. All right. Ugh. And we've got Omega Sentinel here. Last time we got wrecked. No attack bonus. We need an answer to this. So I'm going to, uh, I'll probably do a little research, find out who people are using for her on this node. Uh, since both my alliance mates have already come in, if they have not brought a counter for her, then it's left up to me to try to uh, bring a counter for her. Then we've got Ultron here. Um, <laughs> bleed are more effective. Okay, nice. Um, hmm. Ooh, this Ultron isn't awakened. Interesting. Um, Nebula can handle that. Um, Nebula might be the go-to for this as well. This vigorous assault was annoying. She's unblockable when she gets a regen, and she started out with a regen last time, so that was annoying. But she wasn't under a regen all the time, so um, Nebula might be able to take this fight as long as we can, you know, deal with her unblockable while she has the regen for a little bit. And then just build up the shock and, and get her that way. That might be the play. We'll, we'll see how that goes. Uh, Guardian here um, is not too difficult as long as you go in with somebody that doesn't really need uh, to fire off a lot of specials. So Namor, Nebula, we got, uh, he shouldn't be that bad to fight. Let's see, never back down. Each armor up, yeah. Yeah, that, that shouldn't be that bad. Nebula could do that one if necessary. So, I don't know, maybe... Um... So, I'll bring Nebula and Namor, and I'll check and see who people are using for that Omega uh, Sentinel, and maybe I will bring in another counter for that. So, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. All right, well, let's get on with the fighting. All right, we're in here. Standard team, Nebula, Black Widow Clairvoyant, and Namor. Didn't see anything on the paths that would cause me to bring in anybody else. Uh, the first fight, I believe, yes, Silver Surfer, who I have to fight every day in AQ. And the Silver Surfer that I have to fight in AQ is more annoying than this one but needless to say i get a lot of practice in fighting silver surfer so i went into this fight full of confidence let's see how i end the fight so i'm boosting up like i i always do when i remember uh i want to make sure that i boost up we've got conduit now that makes me a little nervous I don't really like Conduit. And I was sitting here thinking, okay, wait a minute. Namor 
returns the damage as energy. So is this going to be a really bad matchup? Did they find out, you know, I'm using Namor and they picked somebody that was perfect, you know, the global and everything. But I'm looking at this and I'm like, okay, looks like we're not going to have that problem. Because I was worried about that. I was like, oh man, I hope I didn't make a mistake. But it doesn't look like it. He's able to return the damage very nicely. You know, he's putting a little bleed on him. You know, Namor is... I remember when I took Namor up and, and maxed his SIG out. I believe he was the first six star that I took to max SIG. And mostly folks felt it was for prestige. Well, here I am, Alliance War, and I'm using him in Alliance War. I'm so happy he fired that special off. Very annoying when the AI does not want to throw their special. Very, very annoying. But we got done with the fight pretty straightforward and easy. And uh, Conduit didn't play a part, at least not that I could see. All right, next fight is going to be Iron Man Infinity War. Now, Iron Man Infinity War, when I, this is a couple of, well, quite a few seasons ago. I don't remember where it was. Uh, the nodes were different and everything. I got wrecked. I went in with a Black Widow Clairvoyant. She was my best option. It was, it was up. Um, I ended up dying and having to revive once. And the fight was very, very long. So I vowed every time I saw Iron Man Infinity War on this path, I would choose Magneto to take care of it. But the node is different. And I was like, you know what? I might not be able to apply a bleed while he has his armor ups, but the reflective damage should still be there. And as you can see, it is. So we're still doing a decent job. And the true test, of course, is at the end. Now, one thing that I try to do, um, and I did this before when I was fighting Iron Man Infinity War, when he gets really, really low, um, hold your special three and fire it when he gets low. But I had a special three, and I'm like, nah, I'm gonna do that because that also increases my damage because it gives me that mega, mega fear. Look at that, look at the damage. And almost, almost, I got to another special three. Look at that. Ah, beautiful. Now, what I could have done there is you notice that when I fired off that, that heavy, um, I temporarily went to a special three. You time it right, you can get another special three, get two Furies. Uh, if you know what I'm talking about, uh, or if you don't, look on my channel and you'll see. Uh, I think I, I managed to get like three different Furies. All right, so you see right there, I believe that was an Omega Sentinel, wasn't it? Um, I can't remember now. Uh, it's a little bit after I did the first part of this video. Um, but I believe that was probably a, an Omega Sentinel. And that might have been the first time he went against Omega Sentinel with his Red Guardian. And said he just needed a little practice and he could solo. And I believe he soloed her after that. All the time. Alright. So, we've got Ultron. But this Ultron is not awakened. So I don't have to worry about hitting him with energy attacks or anything like that. And him healing up a lot of it. So, it's basically just a straightforward Ultron fight. If you know how to fight Ultron. And he's pretty easy to fight. Keep track of his timer so that you don't try to hit him when he's about to you know go into the uh evade phase because he will wreck you so just kind of keep track of that now we've got guardian and this guardian if you see me fight guardian you already know it's pretty straightforward and i will just attack no specials just attack uh you see the conduit there uh, and I know I was trying to wait. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I think someone needed to get through to Mini Boss Island, if I remember right. I can't remember. I may have waited. Because uh, Conduit 
is annoying. It really is. The longer the fight goes, the more chance, you know, more likely you have to mess up. All right. So, yeah, looks like I did wait. Um, my alliance mate had started on that fight. And I guess the backup came through and finished and went on to mini boss island. And uh, so, as you can see, boss is down. I don't have to deal with conduit. You know, my, my philosophy is why deal with it if I don't really have to. But if they need me on mini boss island or something like that, then just got to push through. But other than that, yeah. All right. So guardian, I decided to go in like that because um, I wanted to make sure that I was not uh, getting wrecked. All right, hold on, I, something beeped at me and I'm like, wait, what? All right, but anyway, uh, I'm just trying to build up. I could have gone and I probably should have done this fight with um, Flair, probably should have. Um, but I didn't. All right, let me see. Sure that. All right. All right, so straightforward fight. Only fire the special three if you're gonna fire a special at all against Guardian. Da -da -da -da. I do like her special. Oh, man. There we go. There's the shot. But Guardian has high energy resistance. So, I'm not, so not the best to fight uh, against this Guardian. And I don't think I did this again. Because it took longer than I wanted. I should have just gone in there with Claire like I usually do. And I would have been able to get the fight done pretty quickly and easily all right so as you saw the boss is already down uh mini boss island is cleared as you see here so we'll be back in a minute and you'll find out how this war ended <laughs> And we're back, and hey, we won one. We lost the last one, but we won this one. All right. Um, let me see. Was it? No, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't a, a close one. <laughs> we got them. We got them pretty good. All right, but that's gonna do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.